Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. You can find the link to download the zip file in the description below. You will find two folders. In start folder, you will find all files you need to follow this tutorial. In the end folder, you will find the final Dynamo script and all related files. Open the downloaded folder. Go to start folder. I have already opened these files the Alux file, Revit project and Dynamo file which is initially empty. The goal for this tutorial is to import these luminaires from the Alux to Revit. So we will use this is the Alux project and as you can see I have just placed two types of luminaires this one and this down lights so just to show you the workflow the first crucial step is to export the CAD file make sure you are in 3d view because if you are in 2d view and you try to export DWG it will not export luminaires as blocks make sure your active view is 3d and then go to this export page uncheck all these options except luminaires and make sure you have set this option one layer per product type now proceed to export export to new file save it so we have successfully exported luminaires because the idea is to get coordinates of these cat blocks and we will use layer name to place different types of families inside Revit so let's jump to Revit now what we can do is link the exported cat file go to insert link cat search for the exported cat file make sure import units are set to meters okay click open so as you can see we have successfully linked our cat file inside Revit now we can jump to Dynamo look for select model element select the link cat link file now look for cat block so make sure you have installed genius loci package dynamo package we, we are going to use this node called cat block connect here hit run so as you can see this node has extracted points block name its rotation and the layer name so if we go down so as you can see the layer not the layer name is not appearing in this list and this is showing null so there is a bug in this node so let first fix it double click on this node so now double click on this python script go to line number 43 and you have to replace this variable geo to i i n s t inst instance this is the variable okay save it close it save the custom node close it and now hit run again so now you are now we can you can see the layer name is appearing in the list so we have fixed the bug okay now what we can do is group our points so look for group by key 
we are going to group the points using layer names hit run so let's check unique keys these must be layer names ok fine and let's check groups so we have two groups fine we need we have a little problem mm, every point is duplicated for three four times in this list so we have to remove these duplicates points so you can we can use prone duplicates hit run so we have successfully removed these duplicates point So the question is how I know which layers correspond to these luminaires. So there's only I think one way and is analyze, analyzing the points. So let me show you a trick to find out which layer the first layer for which luminaire type correspond select all these nodes hide all geometry preview background is empty so look for get item at index connect here look for code block zero index let's check so so we are now we are going to compare this preview model to the Alux model and go to this light page so as you can see these the first layer correspond to these luminaires which are mm, this model so the first layer correspond to these luminaires and you have to select inside Revit which family you want to place okay now let's make a list of family types look for family type I have already loaded two luminaires families so we are going to use these ones look for simple lights simple lights square I'm going to place this family type or this luminaire model and for the layer 2 which is at index 1 these are luminaires and if you go back to the yellow luminaires correspond to layer number 2 which is a downlight so we have to select a different family in our case is downlight click here now make a list list create look for family instance by point just hit run so as you can see we have successfully imported the Alux luminaires here we have the Alux and here we have the Revit project so as you can see this works this is working 
So everything is not linked. You can change the Alux model. Again, refresh the cat link cat file. Go back to Dynamo. Hit run again, and this will update your Revit families inside Revit. 